Hey guys, it's just me checking in again, um, ready to give you a real quick Devo. Um, and I had a couple questions for you. Number one, Connor's whole text message um, about wanting pizza by like 10 a.m. in the morning got me thinking, what is your favorite pizza topping? Um, and what is the last type of pizza that you ate? Okay, my favorite pizza topping is pineapple all time. I love pineapple. I am the pineapple pizza person. Um, and the last type of pizza I ate, I think had lettuce on it. I think it was a BLT slice of pizza from Emilio, so, which is pretty good too, I'm not going to lie. So give me your pizza information, please. And then um, I wanted to ask again if there were any prayer requests, if there was anything that you guys were um, in need of us praying for. Um, let me know that. And then lastly, I wanted to read this first to you that um, I've been meditating on lately. It's from Colossians 2, 7. It says, let your roots grow down into him and let your lives be built on him. Then your faith will grow strong in the truth you were taught and you will overflow with thankfulness. And I've been thinking about that a lot um, with this uh, self-distancing and the church and our response and who we can be and what we can do. And in our house, um, we've been growing a lot in our character. Um, in the mornings, we try to worship together. And through that time, we have really uh, noticed some character issues um, inside of each and every one of us. And through that, we have been able, and since we're self-distancing and we have no other place to go, we have been able to put a lot of time and effort into growing our character, really digging down deep, um, spending time in our rooms, just talking out loud to God, sharing our heart to him, um, and then just sitting and letting him speak to us personally, and then sharing with the other parts of our family what it is that God had said to us. And that's been a really meaningful thing for us. And so I want to put that challenge out to you guys to do that today. Go to your room, go to your special place if you want to go for a walk, um, wherever it is that you can get a Alone with God and just talk out loud to him um, and then stop and let him talk to you. Let him um, just love you, um, maybe give you guidance, maybe give you wisdom, maybe reassure you. Um, Maybe you just need to ask him to forgive you for some things, um, whatever it is that you might need to do. And during this time, let's let our roots grow down into him and let our lives be built on him. We are being stripped away of everything else that we could possibly do, right? You guys can't hang out with your friends. We can't do birthday parties. We can't do youth group. We can't do all of these events and things that we would normally fill our calendars with. And so during this time, let's be productive. Let's not shrink back. Let's be people who are known to dig um, our roots down into him and build our lives on him. Now is a great opportunity for that. And then out of that, your faith is going to grow strong. Out of the self-distancing time that we're walking through, our faith can come out stronger than it ever has before. Let's not waste this time. Um, and we'll overflow with thankfulness. And for any of you who are struggling, um, maybe being irritated or frustrated with circumstances or with school or with your family or with anything that might be going through your head, um, even with your friends, maybe they aren't responding to you, or maybe, you know, who knows what it could be. Um, but what we need in those times is thankfulness, okay? Thankfulness is a great tool to fight back frustration and can uh, passivity um, and irritation. Thankfulness is a great way um, to bust down those walls and to break through that. So if you're struggling in those areas, I would encourage you, again, get alone with God, um, grow your roots down deep into him, build your life on him today by spending some time talking out loud to him and letting him uh, talk to you. So that is my encouragement for you um, on a Wednesday morning when it's a little bit snowy. I miss you guys so, so much. It's really hard not to be with you and not to see you and not to be able to high five you and actually hear you. Um, but yeah, this is my encouragement for you. I can't wait to see you guys again. And let me know your favorite pizza topping and the last type of pizza you ate. Um, and if you can think of it, let me know how you're growing your character and your time at home too. All right. Love you guys. Bye.